Hi, it's Coach Mike again here with Coach Monique from Smash Performance Academy to demonstrate some warm-up drills with floppy disks. No, not the computer kind, but the larger Adidas ones. Don't forget to subscribe and watch some of the other content on the channel. I'm posting six to 10 videos a week of everything we do performance related um, and with uh, athletes, interns, and uh, coaches as uh, crash dummies because uh, they're all better at it than I am. Um, Back to the floppy disks. Okay, so these are made in one, 2.5 and five kilo weights by Adidas and uh, Monique uh, down there. Okay, so you can see the, the different sizes. Basically, they're a, a stitched up disc. I'm not sure what's inside them, but, it, but they're um, moderately heavy. And they've got a hole in the middle, so you can grip them on the outside, you can grip them in the middle. And uh, pretty, pretty versatile. And uh, Luna there wants to play ball, as she does every time. Um, made by Adidas. I don't know if they make them anymore. Um, I bought mine from Rebel Sport, a local uh, sporting good distributor. So I find they're very durable and versatile. We've been using them for um, several years um, and uh, great for warm up drills, hand eye coordination. Great for junior throwers. And oh, trying to get rid of Luna here. And um, the one. Kilo version is great for discus drills as well because uh, sort of they're able to be. <laughs> Beth, come and get Luna. Take her inside. <clears throat> She's about to upset the camera tripod. I can see it coming. Um, I'll get one of the throwers to demonstrate the drills because Monique's a sprinter and uh, uh, doesn't really want to do the, the uh, camera drills. Here we go. Luna, ball. Here we go. You can't see any of this going on, but Luna's. Um, Beth. Yeah, throw it. Left hand to throw it. There we go. Got rid of her. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> we love her, but she's annoying at times. <laughs> okay. Um, like any piece of kit, they have their own special exercises, as you will see. And I really like them as they're soft, can be used indoors, outdoors, for holding, swinging, throwing, and catching, all, all sorts of stuff. Um, you can use them when using mobility and warm up drills to add a little bit of load. Um, I'm actually hard pressed to think of anything equivalent because they are really their own thing, um, but we use them all the time. Okay, so Monique's just going to use the intermediate weight um, and step back a little bit. <clears throat> and we're just going to show you some of the things we, we do with them. Okay, so just uh, touch the ground and stand up, change hands. Okay, so however many you want to do, pretty easy there. Then we flip them one way. Well, I like the overhead version. I tell the kids and athletes not to hold it in the middle, except for a couple of drills we do. And the other way. Okay, goblet squat. Squat and press. Squat and press out at an angle. So all the sort of stuff we do with kettlebells and weights and <coughs> dumbbells and other things, but these are soft and floppy. Okay, um, throwing up and catch. Stuff that's a bit more difficult to do with actual weights, because if thing goes wrong, well, you know, damage someone or something, or, or the floor, <laughs> or whatever. Okay, um, halos, perfect for this. Because I just tell the kids to keep one face against the, uh, the, the head. Okay, split split touches. So do some aerobic stuff. I give the boys the five kilo ones, or the older boys. The younger kids, they just have the one. I've got about 20 of them. So really good drills. Uh, swinging side to side, so swing, swing down to the side and squat. You throw it up a little bit and catch this one. Almost missed it. <laughs> okay, and um, under the leg, pass under the leg. So standing up, that's a good sprinter drill. Just a bit of coordination there. You can go inside to outside and outside to inside. You can have some good, you can have some good posture. So that's a bit harder that one. I think inside to outside is better, but whatever. Um, you can do lunges. We're holding in a goblet. <coughs> Okay, so just add, add a little bit of load. Um, you can do twisting across your front leg. 
okay you can hold it above your head as you do it as well so hip flexor stretches and stuff so look they're, they're, they're very versatile i reckon they're great stuff um swing around the waist and the other way figure eight through the legs and you can you can do this walking as well no it means you can do that <laughs> okay go uh either way um touching to the side of your foot this is good for a bit of lateral movement And I like that you can air and crossing over the body, which I think is even better, particularly for throwers. And you know, you can throw and catch, and if you drop it, it doesn't it doesn't break your foot, and, and they're soft. Um, you can do cleans, okay? So hold it now. Now you do hold it in the hole, okay? So just some, just touch, we normally touch it on the ground, and just clean up to the shoulder, okay? And you can do snatches all the way up. Yep. So again, sort of, it's a, look, they're not that heavy, okay? So you, you wouldn't use it for strength um, and, and conditioning, but for warm ups and a, you know, a bit of a activation mobility, just switch the neural system on. Um, gr great piece of kit. Anyway, um, not sure if you can buy them where you are, but uh, I just thought uh, if you do have something similar, maybe give you a, an idea of a, a range of drills and things that you can do with them. And um, thanks for watching.